This is Log Me in Central Premiere and One to Many Tasks. Over on the left side, we can click on One to Many, where we can see all the tasks that we can run on multiple machines at once. Our six different choices are command line scripts. We can actually put a command line in that we normally would put into terminal or a command prompt window and run it on up to 500 machines at once. Next choice is to do software installation, either an MSI, where we can upload the MSI right here to the options view, and then we can install it on multiple machines, or an EXE. Again, same method where we upload the installer here and then ship it out. We can also replace registry settings by exporting a .reg file from a local registry and then replacing it on all of our target machines. Distribute files lets us ship up to one gigabyte of files at a time to a target destination. And if the files already exist on the machine, we can overwrite those existing files, replacing them with the new ones. Finally, we have custom, where we can do very similar tasks to what we just saw, but this includes additional logging in case you want to use a third-party tool for logging uh, with the command prompt outputs. I'm actually going to walk you through what it's like to install some software on multiple machines at once. So I'm going to go over to the run a batch file or executable, browse for my installer here, and I've got the CCleaner, the anti-malware application installation file right here. Going to upload this. I know on their website they've given the suggestion to use slash s for a silent install. This allows us to install the application behind the scenes so users could actually be on the scene and wouldn't have any idea we're actually doing our software installation. We can see that my exe is already uploaded to the system, so now we can go into save and continue. Create a new plan. And I've got a few different options for my plan here. First I could run it right now if I wanted to, or I could schedule it to run later on. We can pick on the calendar when it's going to run. Let's schedule this for uh, Sunday afternoon when nobody's around. We can also have a window for reconnect. If we're shipping this on a Sunday afternoon and we're shipping to some laptops that happen to be offline for the weekend, we'll give this a one-day window to reconnect. So as soon as that computer gets back online, probably to check email or do another task, we'll make sure to ship out our task. We've got a timeout here. I left this for two hours in case the machine gets hung up. When it's doing the installation, I don't want to crash the computer entirely, so I'll leave a timeout. We can wake the computers uh, using Wake on LAN in case the machines are switched off. And lastly, we can get a roll-up email summary sent to me or to the team with all the computers that we've selected to ship out to. We can pick those computers here that we're going to ship to, and once it's done, we'll get an email where it'll list all the computers if it's a success or a failure. And then down at the bottom, I can click Ship It. The other tasks here work very similar, where you can run command line scripts, do those software installations, either MSI or EXE, ship registry settings, or distribute files in the exact same manner. And this also works for Mac as well. Folks are usually shipping .app files for Mac. This is Log Me in Central Premiere and One to Many Tasks.